Hello and welcome back to Thrift to Treasure with Maria. This is another DIY thread up designer box unboxing that we're doing tonight. And let's get started. This is the last box of five that I ordered in June. All right, this is the top look. I see a purse and I see a scarf. So let's start with the scarf. This is a nice, pretty silk scarf. It's very um, wrinkled, but that's okay because I can just steam it easily. I'm looking to find the brand. And this is Oscar De La Renta. I love the colors. Um, this is nice. I will have to just steam it and post it and hopefully it will have a good resale value. Now let's go to the purse. I mean, this purse is one of the worst conditions that I have received in the boxes. It's a white canvas purse. This is very stained in the back from obviously rubbing on the clothes. Let me see if I can find out who the designer is. It looks like this is 3.1 Philip Limpers, which is nice because they do have a good resale value, but this particular one, I don't know if I'll be able to get the stains out or if it's worth the elbow grease. I'm gonna have to work on this one and see if I just scra scratch it and don't do anything with it and donate it or if it will be if I'll be able to clean it up. Okay, let's move on. The next item is a t-shirt. It's just a black basic tee. It's Versace, which is nice. I have not received the Versace before. Um, okay, the next item is another t-shirt. Lucky me. <laughs> well, this one is Comme des Garçons. And it's the play line that they have. I have seen this before. These have somewhat good resale values. Unfortunately for me, this is a very stained t-shirt. It has multiple stains in the front and multiple stains in the back. I do have a magic potion that I use with stains and maybe I'll do another video guys to show you what I do. I will definitely try to get the stains out because the shirt is an extra large and maybe my son would actually want it. All right, moving on. The next item in the box is a pretty black and white lacy dress. The designer is Millie and the size is six, which is nice. I do like this dress a lot. Millie's dresses have pretty high sale value at you know at the stores but the resale value is not that high i'll be lucky if i can get 50 dollars for this which would not be bad all right the last two items in the box are shoes and sunglasses so let's go first with the sunglasses all right these are really lovely Tom Ford. They look like guys. Sunglasses. They have the green color um, lenses. Actually, they're a very classic shape. I like the simplicity and the minimalistic look of it. Let me see. They're pretty, they're small for my head. Definitely sunglasses for for men. So hopefully these, since it's summer, will go fast. But again, I don't think that I can get more than $50, $60 for, for them after I clean, clean them really nicely. If even that, sometimes they even go for lower than that if you don't have the original box, and I don't. The last item, I think, is the star of the box. Look at this. These are really nice. Mew Mew white leather Swarovski crystal encrusted sneakers. Um, these are very trendy right now, sneakers. Um, even in the fall, people wear them a lot. 
These are in good shape. I just have to put some paper in them to regain their um, original shape. The crystals look like they're in perfect condition as well. I don't see any missing. So yeah, these are good. I have to uh, clean them up and list them as soon as possible. So that's it for this box, guys. The Mew Mew sneakers, the Millie size six, nice black and white dress, Calm de Garçon stained play t-shirt, a black Versace t-shirt, the 3.1 Philip Lim stained bag, and the beautiful silk Oscar de la Renta scarf, and the Tom Ford sunglasses. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great night, and I will talk to you soon. Bye-bye.